Okay, for this physics problem, we're going to do the trajectory of a marble rolling off the edge of a table. And what we hope to find out is how far it hits away from the table and how long it takes to land um, when it hits away from the table. So let's start this off. Let's say the table's two meters high. I know it's a tall table, but humor me. And the marble's going five meters per second. That's also pretty fast, but again, humor me. Okay, so like, you can look back at my other video. It's a little more complicated, but I always start off finding our VY and our VX. But this one's a little nicer since it's a zero degree it's, it's shooting off of. So we can just go ahead, our VY is going to be zero because there's no vertical velocity here. And our only um, velocity which we have is our horizontal, which is our VX, which is going to be five meters per second. Now, I always like to solve these using quadratics, and I always like to solve for time first. I think you have to. Um, so first thing we want to do is do our simple equation, which is it's this one is plus v o t plus one half a t squared. Um, this is our height. This is our distance. This is our um, initial velocity. This is acceleration due to gravity. This is time, obviously. Okay, so let's set this up. So our height is a negative two. It's a negative two because it's going down here, and you need to have a negative two, or else it will mess you up. Most likely, especially in this equation with a small number, you might not notice it. Our distance right here is going to be a non factor it's zero because that's our reference point we're starting off with. Again, we're going to have a non factor here because our y velocity, our horizontal velocity, is also zero because it's firing off horizontally, not at any sort of upwards angle. So we have a zero t. I'm just, you'll see why I write zero t instead of just leaving nothing there in a second plus one half a, which is negative 9.8, that's the acceleration due to gravity, times t squared. Now, like my other video, I like to set things up with a um, quadratic equation, and you can see how this kind of looks like a quadratic equation, I'm going to make it look like one for real right here. So you got negative 4.9, which is one half times negative 9.8, t squared, plus zero t, now you'll see why I'm doing that, and it'll be plus two because we want to get this equal to zero so we're going to add it since it's a negative two now it looks like a lot like a quadratic now we're gonna and for those who don't know the quadratic it's opposite of b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus four a c all over two a so there's your quadratic equation and you can see this is a this is b and this is c now we're going to set this up. I'm going to use a program in my calculator because I'm lazy and don't want to make this longer than it has to be. So A is negative 4.9, B is 0, and our C is 2. So our time, which we're looking for is because we have our T here, it's going to solve for T. Our time is a 0.64. Okay, so we've got that now. Our time is 0.64, and now why I use the quadratic equation is that the reason I use it is so, I mean, you're going to have a little more work here with the quadratic, granted, but you're going to have less, um, um, less, so oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Less times you're going to be multiplying, dividing, stuff like that. So you're going to, instead of, instead of rounding all that many times, you only have to do it once, you're going to get a more precise answer. And then it makes this next part so much easier. So now we have the time it takes to hit the ground. Now we have that, we're going to use our simple equation of distance equals VO, initial velocity, times T. Our distance is what we're trying to find. Our VO is our 5, because it's our horizontal. It's our VX is what we're going to use. Times our time, 0.64, and that equals... X equals 3.2 meters right there, seconds. 3.2 meters. So we know in that short time by using this quadratic equation 
and then the marble will hit 3.2 meters away and it will take 0.64 seconds to get there. Thanks for watching, hope I helped you out.